Hello, my name is Dr. Savan Hilo, the head of male infertility at the Mayo Clinic in Rochester, Minnesota. In this video, I'll discuss success rates for vasectomy reversal. If you haven't already, please watch my videos titled Vasectomy Reversal Overview for additional information. Vasectomy reversal success rates range from 50 to 95%. Pregnancy rates range from 30 to 75% depending on the age of your partner and her fertility. It's difficult to compare success rates from one surgeon to another because there are many contributing factors and different definitions of success. The three main contributors are how long ago your vasectomy was performed, the age and fertility status of your partner, and your surgeon's experience. The most important factor is the time since vasectomy. In general, the shorter the time since your vasectomy, the better. The further out you are from your vasectomy, the greater the likelihood that we'll need to make a more complex connection or epididymovasostomy. The chance of this happening goes up significantly if you're more than 10 to 15 years out from your vasectomy. As a general rule, the younger your partner, the greater the likelihood that you'll be able to get your partner pregnant if your vasectomy reversal is successful. Female fertility starts declining at age 35 and the rate of birth defects or chromosomal abnormalities increases with the age of the mother with a significantly increased risk after age 40. The age of the father also plays a role, although not to the same extent as the age of the mother. An important factor for couples to consider is timing. The older your female partner, the longer it can take to get pregnant. Although sperm can show up as early as a few weeks after the procedure, the quality of the sperm immediately after vasectomy reversal is typically not the best quality. This will improve over time with frequent ejaculation. On average, 73% of couples will be able to get pregnant within 12 months of a vasectomy reversal. For some couples in which the female partner is older than 36 years old, in vitro fertilization may be a better option because you can test the embryos for chromosomal abnormalities during the in vitro fertilization process. By age 40, the chances that a woman will be able to get pregnant through natural conception are 3 to 5% per month, while the chances with in vitro fertilization are 17% with each cycle. I'll compare vasectomy and in vitro fertilization in my video titled Alternatives to Vasectomy Reversal. Vasectomy reversal is a highly specialized procedure that's difficult to perform from a technical standpoint. It requires extensive microsurgery experience. Like anything in life, the more you do something, the better you'll be able to do it. Vasectomy reversal is no exception to that rule. Your best chances of success are to have your procedure performed by a skilled urologist who specializes in infertility and microsurgery. Your surgeon should perform vasectomy reversal on a regular basis at least a few times per month. I'll discuss the top five questions you should ask your surgeon in my video titled Questions to Ask Your Surgeon Before Vasectomy Reversal. At the time of your vasectomy reversal, you can also choose to have sperm frozen or cryopreserved. To do this, a small opening is made in the testicle and a small amount of tissue containing sperm is taken and sent to the lab to be stored. This process doesn't affect the success rate of your vasectomy reversal, but it does cost an additional amount in addition to a few hundred dollars a year for storage fees. If your vasectomy reversal isn't successful, this sperm can then be used for in vitro fertilization without you needing to undergo any additional procedures. The disadvantage of doing this are the additional cost, the likelihood that you won't need to use it since most vasectomy reversals are successful, and the fact that you could always have this procedure performed later if your vasectomy reversal isn't successful and you choose to pursue in vitro fertilization. You should be aware that even if you have sperm in your ejaculate a few months after vasectomy reversal, that connection can scar down over time. If you had sperm present on an initial semen analysis but haven't been able to get pregnant after six months, consider repeating a semen analysis to make sure that sperm are still present. You can also consider banking or storing sperm if your vasectomy reversal is successful in the case that it does scar down over time because an ejaculated sample will typically have enough sperm that could be used for intrauterine insemination, which is less costly than in vitro fertilization. I hope you found this video from the Mayo Men's Health Moments series informative. 
Please view my videos on questions to ask your surgeon before vasectomy reversal and alternatives to vasectomy reversal or options if vasectomy reversal fails for further information. If you'd like to schedule your vasectomy reversal, please fill out the online questionnaire on mayoclinic.org or contact us using the info pictured on your screen. This is Dr. Savan Hilo from the Mayo Clinic signing off. Thanks for watching.